Well, good afternoon, everybody. I found out something interesting on the ICOM. I thought the meter was looser on the ICOM in the 101 Yezu. But no, it ain't. It's uh, the noise floor. The noise floor. I have no preamp on the Yezu. I have no preamp turned on on the ICOM. And I'm running the... About a six to almost a seven noise floor on five megahertz. See right here, preamp one, preamp two, preamp off. Okay, on the Yezu, let's see right here. I'm running uh, two S units of noise. Hang on just a second. Well, I ain't got no noise. I had preamp one on. Okay. And I've noticed on 60 meters and all the other hand bands, if I if I got if I got like a seven noise floor on the ICOM and I got a one a one or zero on the A, so I get this S9 signal on somebody talking or ten over nine on both radios so the meter ain't loose on the icom it's just the icom's got more noise let's see right here is ipo if i go to ipo2 i got about a seven noise floor but right here's ipo turned on no noise and here's the icom Look out to the difference. And I thought the needle or the meter was looser on the ICOM and the AC, but no, the ICOM's got a lot more static on it than the AC does, so the AC is a quieter radio. Don't start hating on me. Uh, please don't start hating on me, ICOM lovers. I'm not uh, trying to throw off on the ICOM. I do love the menu systems of the ICOM if the Yezu had the, the menu systems like this instead of like this the, the Yezu would be a perfect radio but the Yezu every time I do something in the menus I had to read the book or watch a video it's a real it's a real hard radio to operate it's not user friendly like the ICOMs are but I guess if you get used to it, it gets a little bit better. But still, yet the icons are so much easier to use. The icons has got the same uh, menu structures, and the Yezus are just stacked on top of each other. So like this right here, that's that's the ninety seven hundred. This, for example. But that's the biggest pet peeve I got against the Yezu is I, I'm not crazy about the menu systems. Which I love the menu systems on the icon. Like this right here. I mean, the menu systems are a lot easier to use. But yeah, I wanted everybody to see the difference. And I don't have no preamp on. The preamps, you can see, it's off right there. Now if I... Okay, right there, the preamp one, preamp two, and right there, it's off. It's uh, S, about a S5. About a S5. Right under a S5 noise floor. And on the Yezu, it's S0. Like I said, the needle ain't loose, or it's just the icons picking up more noise. But I've noticed this on the, you know, when I talk on 60 meters, I'll be getting uh, S9 on, on, I'll be getting S9 or 10 over, 20 over S9 on somebody talking. And I'll have a lot less noise on the Yezu. 
But like I said, I'm not bashing the, I'm not bashing Icon, but the Yezu is a more quieter radio, and people's been asking me, uh, you know, is that the radio I use most of the time? Yeah, when I work DX, I got 200 watts, plus I got a quieter noise floor, plus I got roofing filters. The, Ye the ICOM don't have. The Yezu's got mechanical roofing filters. And it's got uh, a mechanical mixer. It's got DSP plus SDR on top of that. And I think that's better than this. It, this is its only standard SDR. There's no roofing filters. There's DSP but no roofing filters. And I think that uh, I got the best of both worlds, which I still like the icons. But like I said, if the menu system was like this right here instead of like that, it would be perfect. The radio would be perfect. That's, on, that's my biggest pet peeve of 101. I do not like is their menu system. I do not like none of the Yezu menu systems. And that's what I really like on the Icon. But which one are you going to hear the better? So uh, a DX, a real weak DX station, you're going to hear it better on the 101 MP. And uh, like I said, uh, I know these people uh, that uh, that's really true and blue Icon, which I, I used to be an Icon man. I'm still an Icon man. I still like Icon. But the 101 MP is a higher dollar radio, and you can tell a difference. And Sherwood Engineering rates, rates this number one. And I believe this is number 12 or number 15, the 7610 is. And you can see the difference and hear the difference. You can pull out weaker signals on the Yezu and you can the ICOM. I just wanted to shoot this video real quick. I'm going over seven minutes, so I don't want to have a long, long video or nothing like that. But I want to wish everybody well and uh, I hope you enjoy my videos. But this is what I found out that... Uh, the icon meter ain't loose. It's just got a lot more noise floor. So, uh, let me see. Let me switch back to the icon, which uh, I like. I like both radios. But anymore, uh, I do use uh, this and here the DX with, and I got this and hooked up to the computer on my logging program. I don't have this and hooked up to my computer. I went to Walmart the other day and they said they don't sell printer cables no more, USB cables, so I guess I'll have to get me one off of Amazon anymore. You have to order anything. Nobody's got nothing. So, uh, again, thanks for watching my video. Thanks for uh, subscribing. Thanks for leaving a comment and a thumbs up. May everybody have a blessed day. Uh, 73s and good DX.